What's up guys, this is RG giving you another high definition broadcast. As you can see, we're here back on Unison League and we are going to be talking about the Brides Resolve as well as some of the new stuff uh, in the update. So let's go ahead and get into it now. Um, this basically is going to give you a UR set of armor pieces that is also defense and magic defense equal so you know you can get um an equal amount of defense from, and magic defense from these but the skill actually is magic damage down for both of them magic damage down xl which is very very good so if you guys don't have any magic damage down xl gear you definitely want at least one of each of these or two armors you know whatever you want to do you can mix and match um you can get have uh, duplicates of each something to note though is you can only get the uh, armors from the bride uh, bash of the bridegroom so you don't want to keep spamming that other quest um also this um three or the tree three the tree god uh Alras, or whatever his name is is actually pretty good if you haven't gotten uh, all five of your alices um on the last quest i only got three so if i get two more of these guys then i'll have like a five set that i can actually go into like a hunter uh, class uh and burst dps with so you know if you're if your uh archer hunter ranger is lacking in uh greens you definitely want to keep uh spamming this quest until you get a good amount of, or as much of these ssr greens as you want honestly his skill to me is really not good but his stats are really good for an ssr they're actually better than alice's stats as ssr not as you are obviously so um basically what you want to do is uh keep spamming this quest if you if you need the items obviously and let's go ahead and check um our notices so we can look at the next thing um the spawn is actually a really good spawn for me personally and i think it's a really good spawn for other people um pretty much all of this stuff that um you can get from this is good uh especially for me the magic testament staff is good the armors are really good and um like especially this armor right here this uh true imperial suit it's like really perfect for me if i can get it um even the even the dress is really good but um the monster specifically is very very good it has like um the soldier's uh, buff with a 25 percent uh, instead of 30 but it's 25 percent hp for all allies uh for 50 seconds so that's really good and it uh removes debuffs so it's a really good um, monster, and the the reason that uh, I think it's great is because of the magic defense and um, defense it gives as a as a uh, blue monster. I'd like to have two of them if I could, or at least one of them. But uh, I probably will be doing this uh, this uh, spawn event because it is a two SSR event. Um, but the thing is, is that. Uh, a lot of the times they'll they'll come in at like the middle or last like two or three days of the week um where it's gonna go away and then they'll put like a spawn out like that's like incredibly good so i kind of want to wait until that moment because it says right here as you can see the limited time ends in seven days so i have seven days to like really kind of let them come out with all the cool stuff uh and like ideas for the week uh and stuff they want to pitch to us uh for spawning so I kind of want to wait till that for that. But if you guys have any like videos or something that uh, somebody has done it and experienced this spawn, tell me what you think and uh, tell me what you got in the comments below. But uh, let's go ahead and continue on um, to the guild. Uh, so rank guilds uh, battles are underway as you can see here and they're going to last for one week. Uh, and one thing that I kind of like really didn't know about beforehand, um, like I guess like I would say like 24 hours ago is that the league medals rewards have changed so i was actually in uh i'm in the same guild right now so i was in uh, a block c um guild before and then um we actually had to acquire a block b guild so that we could uh actually get the medals that i need and since just being in this block b guild i guaranteed myself a weapon because i already have 10 gold medals and i just have to be participating in the guild battle or i don't even know if i even have to if, but i will get the weapon because 40 plus 10 is 50 and 50 is for uh, the weapon but we are trying to go ahead and get to like top 10 uh i mean it would be nice to be number one but i we are trying to get to top 10 we uh see ourselves getting to top um you know 99 
but uh, you know it you know not never uh, it's never certain and uh, anything could happen but uh, I do see ourselves getting to around uh, you know 99 plus uh, so 70 medals uh, give or take but um, you know that's just uh, an optimistic view uh, and I don't know exactly how it's gonna go down uh, so you, if you are in a Block C guild, your maximum uh, number of medals will be 40 if you get first place. And I doubt, like most, you know, it's only one person, so uh, one guild. So one guild is going to get 40. And the only reason, only way you would get it is if you got some medals last season. And then you switch guilds and then you're uh, in a Block C guild again. So those of us in Block B guilds uh, are going to get a good amount of medals just for participating, really. Uh, and that's why we had to acquire a Block B guild, or else it would be just pretty much impossible for anyone to get um, medals. So that happened. Um, also, guild battles, I will be showing the end results of like um, how we did in guild battles, uh, and I will probably cast some of the higher ranker ranking guilds that we fight. However, we uh, like took out these guys in like less than a minute because they were. Uh, let me just see like they were like level 10 crystal and um, level 6 crystal you know the next guy is probably like level 5 or like 9 crystal so these guys are gonna get taken out like pretty handily pretty easily um, in within like a minute or two so I don't want to really show like a bunch of stomping videos where we just stomp them um, because it's just not gonna help you out uh, however it might be interesting to watch i don't know probably not though it's just going to be a uh, stomping like low levels so um i'll show you guys something that is interesting when i cast it like i'll cast all my uh, battles and make sure that i find one that's either interesting or it was a good battle uh so that we can uh we can cast that and help you hopefully help you guys out with your guild battles during the week or or whatever so that's where we're at right now um one thing I actually been meaning to do is uh, show you guys how to like contribute to your guild correctly. Um, well, I guess there's not really an uh, incorrect way to do it, but um, you would definitely want to do like super augments during the weekend, uh, get your gold up to a high level, and then be able to contribute. Um, right now, I'll go ahead and contribute uh, to the guild. Uh, it says that we need about right here you can see it's about three million gold that we need for uh level 18 so i'm gonna go ahead and put in a million gold real quick let's see how much is this five million now so uh i'll put a million gold here and then look at the hp the defense magic defense and the members hp also look at how uh what kind of buff i'm getting for like a contribution okay so if I contribute that 1 million gold, uh, we'll go ahead and do that now. Uh, blah, blah, blah. So I have like I have 6 million 300 gold, so 1 million gold to me is it's not too bad. Uh, but uh, I do need like a, around 3 million to to be safely able to augment that uh, what's the name? Uh, the the new uh, monster, the the water monster up to the level that I want it to be at. Uh, you, you, are, you are 70, so do this and uh, you get a buff from this attack up this is like something that I definitely didn't need however I don't think uh, you can actually get a different uh, boost every time you uh, contribute um, but I'll go ahead and do it again because it doesn't really um, I mean I don't really need boosts for the beginning couple battles uh, so I'll just do it one more time uh, and see how much I'll get or you know what? I'll do 500,000 so I can just see if I uh, can get another boost. Oh, you know what? I'll I'll even do this. I'll do like the 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 minimum amount, which is like the 500 gold, and see if I can get a different boost from this. So no. All right. So if I put another million in, I don't think I would have got another boost, different boost. So what I'll do is uh, I'll contribute the million today. Then tomorrow I'll do another million, and then another million the next day. Depending on how, uh, like what kind of guilds we're fighting. Like if tomorrow we're fighting a level 20 crystal guild, I'll probably just go ahead and put the two million in then, just so I can we can have that buffer of uh, HP, defense, magic defense, and um, 
and the HP of the crystal as well. So you know the, the HP is here. You can see the HP of the crystal and the HP of your members. So. Uh, sorry I didn't get to show you uh, how much uh, 17 to 18 goes, but I'll put that in the description below so you guys can see like the crystal HP for each uh, level uh, so that uh, you know it wasn't wasted. So, uh, or maybe I'll just put it in annotation so it's like right all, all over the place uh, here so it's easy to see. Um, so I think that's it for this one guys. I will be coming back with another uh, video in terms of the class. Because a lot of people have been coming at me and saying, I, I, like, I want you to continue the class um, videos and making the um, you know, more available to uh, the public of like pro strategies and what you would bring to like a GVG match so that they could show their members. So I will go ahead and do that um, next. So I think that's going to be it for this one. If it guys helped you out a little bit, then tell me... Um, tell me what's up and uh if it didn't help you out you could uh, thumbs down it i just wanted to go through a real quick um review of what happened and then i also um give you a video on uh what the event is and how to do it so maybe i'll do the event one right after this and then i'll do the uh class since it's, it's so uh quickly um you know everybody's trying to do the event and wants maybe know to, to know how to do it correctly all right so i'll go ahead and uh, leave you guys with that Thank you guys for watching and take it easy. Peace.